morning, friends. I greet you in the good news of Jesus Christ from Haiti, in particular from St. Andre's Episcopal Church in Esch. This is the base camp we've been at for the last five days. And I'm filled by the spirit by the people of Haiti. You know, despite being one of the poorest countries in the world, despite the hunger, the lack of fresh water, the lack of health care, the lack of education, and often the lack of hope, I'm filled by a great spirit by these amazing people. Indeed, they're not poor in spirit. They have a spirit that's alive and well, a spirit that has transformed me and our group. You know, it's that spirit, that same spirit that St. Bartholomew is, is growing right now. It's a spirit of, of, of a possibility. It's a spirit of bringing that to other people, hand by hand, face by face, interaction by interaction. It's a spirit that's, that, that's, that's completely consuming of the body. It's a spirit that changes our lives. And so I greet you with that same spirit. I, I pray that this Sunday and this week ahead for you, you receive the gift of that spirit. I pray that you are freed, freed from blindness to the joy of God's blessings around you, freed to live a life of joy and to give that abundantly to others. So please pray for me. Pray for, for Jim and J.D. and Kate as we complete our trip here. Pray for the people of Haiti. Pray for the work of the Episcopal Church here. Pray for Dice San Diego and St. Bartholomew's. And yes, pray for me as we pray for you every day. And God's grace will continue to be known to us. And God's healing grace will be realized by others. And that the joy will overflow in our hearts together. I'll see you soon. God bless. Bye-bye.